What's up, everybody? Noak is back here for your daily video. Ooh, there goes the camera. I almost dropped you guys. I am so sorry. I might be a little bit loopy, but it is 1 o'clock in the morning on Tuesday, August 29th. And The Hollers stars John Krasinski, Anna Kendrick, Charlie Day... Margot Martindale and Richard Jenkins and it's all about um, John Krasinski's mother who has a tumor inside of her brain the size of a softball and they didn't really know the symptoms uh, the mom and the dad didn't really know the symptoms, uh, numbness of the fingers, and uh, part partial loss of vision in one eye. So they're trying to deal with that, but also John Krasinski is dating Anna Kendrick's character, and they're about to have a baby. They're about to have a kid. And he's dealing with that. So it's basically a lot on John Krasinski's character. And I gotta say this was absolutely fantastic. Now, I'm gonna put this out there. This movie made me cry. The reason it made me cry, I'm pretty sure. Spoiler. Spoiler alert. The mother does end up passing away in the movie. But I lost my grandma. Uh, to pretty much that same exact thing. And today is her birthday. So first of all, happy birthday, grandma. But back to the movie. This was a... I watched Cool Duders. Yeah, I watched Cool Duders' uh, review of this. And he said this was a heavy drama. I'm not going to call it a heavy drama. I'm going to call it a heavy dramedy. This had some comedy in it. This did have some comedy of it. Comedy in it, no doubt. No doubt in my mind it had some comedy in it. But I am going to say this, that if you don't like heavy dramedies, this is not, or if you can't handle, um, num, num, or if you can't handle heavy dramedies, then this is not the movie for you. Oh, no, 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 no. By far not the movie for you. But if you are okay with stuff like this, then go for it. The acting was absolutely fantastic. The reason why I wanted to see it is because of the runtime. I love I love short movies. Sometimes they are complete crap. Sometimes they are great. This one was really great. Sadly, this is not a 2017 movie. Or this would be on my top whatever list I make it. Because I am at, I think, 270 reviews for this year. To me, that's pretty darn good um and another reason is because I just love Anna Kendrick she is endlessly watchable and I'm not just talking about how pretty she is she can act she can act perfect comedic timing she can go back and forth with the best she has another movie coming out this year called Pitch Perfect 3, which I am really looking forward to. Her last movie I saw her in was uh, Happy Christmas. Didn't much care for that one, really. This one was absolutely fantastic, and I'm going to give The Hollers an A. Stay tuned, guys. I might have one more movie left in me for tonight. After all, it is... Um, and I'm going to, there you go, 
After all, it is 1.05 in the morning. So, I will see you guys next time. So, as always, if you liked this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, I am so sorry, but you clicked on the stupid thing. But if you did, please like the video, leave a little comment down below, and subscribe for more. And I will see you guys next time.